Human Settlements Department in the Free State paid 255 million rand for the asbestos project to find out how many houses in the province still had roofs containing asbestos. Uh, the job was contracted and around 36,000 houses were audited at a cost of about 21 million rand. Seven suspects, including former Free State Human Settlements MEC Olim Lamlele, appeared in the Bloemfontein Magistrates Court on charges of fraud, money laundering and corruption. They were all released on bail ranging between 50,000 and 500,000 rand. For an update, we now cross live to our colleague, Mahala Masiteng. Mahala, very good morning to you. What's the latest on this development? Good morning, Desiree. Yes, we are coming live from Duck City in Bloemfontein. This is the area where we find some of the houses with the asbestos roofs. And we are coming here just to get the latest of how residents are feeling in terms of the latest development. As you have just said, that seven people have been arrested, including uh, some government officials related to the asbestos saga. And we are also here again just to get the feeling of their living conditions. As you can see behind me, as they were just telling us, the issue here is not just about the asbestos uh, roofs, but the conditions, the living conditions are not good at all. But we are here, of course, just to get uh, their feeling about the latest development, how they are feeling with uh, the arrest uh, of the officials uh, in, in relation to the asbestos roofs. And of course, they are going to take us through their living conditions as they've been telling us that their living conditions are not good at all. They are getting sick. But here with me, I'm with some of the residents. I'm here with Ausi Kidiboni Tinte, who will just tell us about what is happening where they are living currently. Metinte, thank you very much for joining us today. Just take us through uh, your living conditions. Yo, I'm sick, Mama. Okay. Just take it, okay. I'm sick and about this uh, abestos. Okay. Abestos. Then now, since uh, I, 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 I sick last of last week, then my chest is not good about this asbestos. And we are getting sick and I live with this child this child is not good about this life in these areas. Uh, can you just try and, and speak louder? Just, just tell us, how long have you been living here? It's a long time. Uh, it's about 10 years we're living here. Yes, 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 ma. So how are you feeling about the latest development of people being arrested in relation to uh, the, this issue of asbestos roofs? I'm very glad because we are struggling. Uh -huh. What is it that you want to see happening about these guys? Uh, I want to see to rot the jail. Yeah. Because. But we are safari is a whole me. Can I go eat a lily? Hasa Hono, Hara Hono, Bona, develop a Kamunakare, Dak City. Because Kima Pilo Arona Akamuna, Bona Badula Hamna to go to Lente, Rona Hari Pele Hans Hoha, Matu Ana Awa, Ene, Huduma Awa, Lady Services Takamo Hadisha, next. Hang on, I see this hand lit or hang. No genana high salary modis or madru, who to go to Sakamuna, who honor who who look is Matu Aduzi fell, how never to begin on Hona, or not to see the Kamuna, Kamuna Kamukuli Lankate. So every on a high and so a handle, and even Gasol and so a handle, but no genan and the Gukula, I can amnat to Hoha. I can amnat do like you cool, like maybe for Covid, he let Liniking, the Gihotol, a high to Gintabaya as best to sell his Rame second and Gamu Samiti at Hanka, Hamadwana, Apuile Marulel. Thank you very much. Uh, that is Mekidi Bonitinte just taking us through uh, their living conditions. She's saying that they are getting sick from time to time. And she's also uh, telling us about what she will, want, she will want to see happening, of course, with people being arrested uh, in relation to this uh, asbestos saga. And she's telling us that the living conditions are not good at all uh, in this area. And they want to see uh, just 
difficulties uh, with these issues and uh, she's also taking us through uh, the fact that they've been told a long time ago that they will be removed uh, from this area and be taken to other uh, areas so that they can have a good living conditions but to this date uh, there's still no answer no no changes with uh, their living conditions so this is some of the issues uh, related to what is happening here with residents uh, really living under these conditions but again we have another resident who will tell us about uh, their conditions in that thank you very much for joining us no, no, no. Uh, just tell us your living conditions here it's not nice ndiwa but uh, 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 you 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 spoke about the issue of of toilets. Do you have toilets in the house or are they outside? Because yes, I'm trying in, to in look. The, I don't see them. Essentially, ma'am. Essentially, but come come in I like no space. We are born a hagle happy. I a pants. We are born in a pants. But they are nipsu and learn. Uh, what do you want to see happening with with the issues of people uh, being uh, uh, accused of of dealing with with, with this asbestos? But being like that, then the councillor is to be councillor. Yes, I want to influence like like even even the devotion like you go about like we shall not end, but I'm not end. So in two hours, I was in that good. So then, like you say, I'm not sure. Say, John, I'm not doing that, but you're wrong. So I couldn't do it. Funny guess, teen, can we? Uh, uh, Ask it. What he talked about? How you uh, you are getting sick because of this asbestos roofs, and how are the conditions when it's raining uh, and things like that? Can you take us through that? Hey, ma'am. Do you do you get sick because of of asbestos? I am not. Car, car. The chest. I I I I am not. I am not good in the on the shop. But I I just get some money. I good in the it's a good share. Well, those are some of. uh, conditions that people here at Duck City are living under. They are also complaining about the space. As you can see, these houses are very small and there's no privacy at all. And they are also complaining, of course, of uh, the conditions all in general in this area. And they say that they have been promised that uh, they will be taken to a different area. But to this date, there's still nothing happening. And they are also complaining, of course, uh, about about the other service delivery and also complaining about the councillor in this area and all they want to see is just justice uh, to prevail on this matter. Desiree? Thank you so much for bringing us up to date.